It's hot. It's hot. It's another incredible, powerful piece. Blood of the Root, it was inspired by the Gina Six in Louisiana when protests broke out after a group of students got into a fight, a racially charged fight at a local high school, which resulted into the six black students being accused and eventually charged of murder for a schoolyard fight. Very impactful, very powerful. Very provocative. I'm so moved. I got this captured. I wept, I cried, most pleasantly surprised. Every time the actors came on stage, I had goosebumps. It was so exciting and vital. The image of the tree, especially, and the students creating it together, and not only like the characters and how they embody not only themselves, but also larger ideas. And that's when everybody see three nooses hanging on the branches of that great oak tree. Three nooses? Three nooses? That's what everybody said. Three nooses hanging on the branch of that great oak tree. I just think it's such a, a stunning example of political theater and what theater can do to make us open our hearts, to make you know people who are on the margins understood, to, to allow lives that have been pushed to the, the cracks and crevices of our society be seen. And it brought back a lot of memories from the 60s up until now. A lot have changed but remains the same. No side really makes sense when I've always just existed in the cracks. So when they come asking me where I stand, what am I saying? You got black kids protesting, and a white kids pranking. Who, whose side I'm supposed to be on? I feel like the civil rights and you know, all that was a long time ago, and this reminded me it's not at all. It's very present today. And I'm very excited to see that we're having this uncomfortable conversation. Feeling a little bit guilty that this isn't more top of mind and eager to try to remedy the situation but not really sure how to do that. It don't matter your hurt, it don't matter your pain. Black based male body is always a blame. It's the rules, it's the rules, they remember the rules. Everybody gonna fight, only you do the time. It was the talk back that was really, really encouraging for me because after such an uncomfortable play, you would like to know what people are talking about and what they're thinking. We've traveled the play all over the world, from Africa to Australia to Scotland to London, and now here home to Roost in Harlem, in our community. So it's a social protest piece, so it's wonderful to be in the community that the play is hopefully intended to inspire.